How's it going everybody? KCB3 here with some quick gaming news. I'm trying to do this video pretty much as quick as I can. Um, you know, my other video I did yesterday was at least 10 minutes long, so you know, trying to make it short. Pretty much this uh video I'm going to talk about is uh it was a new Batman uh, Arkham Origins multiplayer that came out. Uh the trailer that came out today. We do know that uh since the review of the Batman Arkham Origins, the game that's actually come out this fall, when the review that you know Batman Arkham Origins was gonna come out this fall. There was going to be some multiplayer um, elements to it. We didn't know anything to it at that point, but we did know that Deathstroke would be playable, a playable character in the multiplayer game. Now we've seen the trailer, and it seems kind of interesting and creative by standpoint. Um, to be honest, it's like a minute and sixteen, a minute and sixteen seconds. They have uh, it's like a two versus two versus no three versus three versus three. Uh, and the trailer showed uh, a, a gang of Joker, uh, a Joker gang, he Joker himself, and two other people uh, versus Bane, uh, and two of his henchmen, and uh, Batman and Robin. Now, the scenario, I have no idea how this game going to go. Pretty much, you know, like three on three on two. They can probably, to me, honestly, I thought it was going to be like a gang war, like probably, pretty much territories. Uh, probably uh, one gang had to, you know, take over all the glory. I don't know, take over different territories or something we did see some action within it it probably can have multiple game modes so one thing i'm probably saying is uh they probably got a territory type of scenario capture the you know territories and stuff a gangland whatever uh three on three um it can also do a team deathmatch or some type of scenario uh, i don't know it just seems so crazy uh haven't really seen any you know any video dealing with this you know IGN usually talk about it. I haven't seen no video I just seen the trailer myself seems kind of weird but it seems kind of interesting uh you know you got uh Robin and uh Robin and Batman so I don't I to be honest I have no idea what to think about this now one thing I can say is the game looks very creative very interesting at least uh, I hope we see more gameplay uh, I'm probably not, the, you know, I'm probably not even explaining this the best I can, you know, just because I haven't seen the full thing from, um, you know, IGN and them talking about it, actually explaining it a little bit deeper. Um, so yeah, um, other news, other news. Um, oh, be, oh, before I move on, this is pretty much like a little bonus to the game, you know, it's not really going to take over, you know. Most people who get in this Batman game is playing for a story single player. 99% of the gameplay is going to be on the single player. Probably 1%, probably 2%, 3 going to be on the multiplayer. Like I said, it looks interesting, but the single player is what you know many people are looking for. And I think many people or majority of people are going to focus their time on. Now, the Wii U is the only uh, set piece, is the only system out there not getting the multiplayer aspect. I think one of the reasons was that uh that uh, Warner Brothers were working well um wanna just wanna work on systems like Xbox and um PlayStation. Just wanna work on um the systems that had uh multiplayer, you know, multiplayer good development. Many people, you know, play multiplayer games on Xbox three sixty and um uh, PlayStation three. So they just want to focus on those two systems that are very, you know, very growing on um, you know, very good dealing with online multiplayer type of things uh very popular in the multiplayer aspects you know we you that's pretty much why do we use not get the multiplayer thing which is kind of stupid to me uh you know we you like i said it's not getting the support it needs like since last year it's not even getting the support ea don't want to work with them don't want to give them the frostware it's not even getting the battlefield 4 game that's coming out this year for the ps4 and the Xbox One, also the current gen consoles, the PS3 and the Xbox 360, is not getting any of that, which is kind of, you know, I don't know why. And uh, just because of this, this is kind of stupid. Is this, you know, it's not very popular wise on multiplayer. So you're not giving this console a uh, an online experience because of that. That's stupid. Just like Injustice, when Injustice came came out for the Wii U version. It was only the single player. They didn't have the multiplayer aspect in there. A couple of weeks later, they actually had to patch up for the uh, online features. You know, it's kind of, you know, stupid. It's, it is showing that we use not actually getting the respect. Like, you know, it's getting treated fairly like the other systems, which is, you know, painful to see. You know, it's kind of crazy.
I don't know. I, I hope in the near future that uh you know get Wii U gets more su- support. You know, same thing. Um, you know, I don't know. I, I just hope it gets more. Res- you know, re- support and more respect. Pretty much all to say the new battle, the new Batman um uh, multiplayer trade. What do you think of it? I didn't probably explain it as well as I know, but I do know three versus three versus two with Batman and Robin as the second one. So it's like you have a little game war territory type of thing. It looks like a fun, cool experience. Um, like I said, I haven't really went in more details or, or with it because I haven't seen the actual video of uh you know IGN or GameSpot breaking it down. So, you know, I just came in. Uh, but what do you guys think of it? You think it's interesting? You think it sucks? You think it's garbage? You know, like I said, the main part of the Batman Arkham Origin game is going to be for storyline. This bonus, this, you know, this interesting creative type of multiplayer modes, those are going to be, you know, 1%, 2%. So that's that i think it's pretty good but you know the other not good thing about it is the wii u is the only system that's missing out because you know i guess it's not very popular wise on the multiplayer uh aspect um popularity so it just shows wii u again is not getting the respect it needs like comment subscribe um kcb3 as always everybody have a wonderful day wii u i hope it gets support real soon because uh, right now, it's not getting respect it needs. KTV3, I'm out.